Take a look at the tropics. There is a lot going on. We have Hurricane Danielle here in the northern Atlantic. Won't bother anyone for the next few days. That's Hurricane Earl, which is getting closer to Bermuda. We have one strong tropical wave here on the eastern Atlantic, another one coming off the west coast of Africa. So things are getting a lot more active. Here's Earl. Winds are at 85 miles an hour. It's moving to the north at 8. It's going to take a curve to the northeast. It's going to come close to Bermuda. It's not going to get a direct hit, but it's going to be on the western side of the storm. And look at this. Is it going to become a major hurricane? Could be a category four by Friday and will go up into the North Atlantic. There's so much activity and energy with this system. It's going to be sending swells up along the East Coast. So even in Virginia, our coastal communities may see some minor coastal flooding uh, later today and into the day tomorrow and Friday as well. So even a storm that's way off to our east will give us at least a minor impact. And the reason why things are getting so active is the water temperatures are at their max, wind shear is at its lowest, and we normally get our peak hurricane activity around September 10th. So this is why the things are starting to heat up across the Atlantic.